welcome back to the channel so in this video i'm just going to be sharing with you how you're going to be able to just use signal app on your desktop or on your pc and this implies to both mac and then windows so what you have to do first is you go to the website of signal because you cannot get the app in the app store of macbook or you cannot get it in the app store of windows when you go to the website you just have to scroll down and you're going to see download right here you see it's compatible for android iphone ipads windows mac and then linux so i'm using mac right now so i'm just going to hit on mac so i'm going to hit on download right away and then we see how it's going to look like and this pop-up is going to come another screen is going to come and it's going to start downloading right away and i think we will just have to wait whilst it downloads and we do the necessary setup so that you get to know how it is really going to work okay so I chose my download option to pop up on desktop so you're gonna see it right here and it's done so I'm just gonna double click that is for Mac if you are using Mac OS this is what you have to do and you double click and it's gonna verify the application do the necessary installations and you're gonna see a pop-up like this so when you see a pop-up like this too on your PC what you have to do is you press hold this and then drag it to this side in order to install it in the application i already have it so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to stop because if you already have it you don't need to just reinstall it again it's just not going to help it so i'm just going to delete this and eject and then delete and i'm going to go to the app right here so you can go to the app through here or right here so i'm just going to hit on the app right now and you see this pop-up is going to come link your phone to signal desktop so all your chats you have on your phone right is gonna pop up right here so you can just use your phone or your desktop that is your phone needs to be connected to signal too so that you'll be able to just use the signal on your desktop so if maybe you are away from your phone and then someone texts you on signal you want to message someone on signal you can just use the desktop version and then you can just type anything you feel like you want to type to the person and then you are good to go so i'm going to go to my phone and show you the steps of how you're going to be able to just link this to your desktop in order to just get your chats pop up so this is the necessary steps you need to do when you want to link up if you're using android you need to go to signal settings that is the app settings you go to linked devices and then you press the plus button in order to just attach it you're going to see a bar camera that is going to pop up and then you're going to show it to the screen like this which i'm going to show you right away and when you go to an apple device being an iphone or an ipad what you're going to do is you go to signal settings link devices and then link new device and you're going to see the bar camera and then you're going to use it so stick around so that you don't miss anything okay so what you're going to do next is you're going to open your signal app right so after opening your signal app you're going to hit on the three dots right here and then you hit on settings and then you scroll down and then you're going to see it this right here link device right here so you hit on link device and you see this plus sign right here that was what they were showing us you're gonna hit on the plus sign like this and then on your screen like this there's gonna be a screen showing a camera right so you're gonna use the camera to face the desktop right now we are seeing right here and you're just gonna connect your messenger to your desktop so i'm gonna hit on the plus sign and i'm gonna see the camera like this okay so i'm just gonna show it like this and that's connected so what you're gonna do next is you hit on link device and it's gonna link the device so you see that is it so i can choose to use the name or i can change it so what i'm going to use is e and i'm just going to hit on finish linking and it's going to start linking and syncing my contacts from my phone to the laptop so basically this one can really help you probably maybe you might have something on your phone you want to transfer directly to your desktop or your computer and you might not be having maybe a cable or something i'm just saying you can just transfer the file right away which wouldn't need you to just connect cables and you're just good to go you just move it and then everything is going to work perfectly for you so don't forget to subscribe to the channel and then like the video for more tips like this this side you're going to see my contacts who have joined the app so far and the group when you check on my phone too is the same thing i have right here so you can see the first name is ajiman right there and then chris and then Kobe Jones and then Cypher that is the same thing I have here so when I hit on self like this and then message note to self and I type in hi like what I was showing you transferring data from your phone to your PC so you see hi right here and it's popped up it's still me who sent this and I'm just gonna say are you home 
and it's just gonna pop up again right here so maybe I want to send a picture from my phone to the laptop I'm just gonna do it right away so maybe a pic of myself and let me just send it and you guys are gonna see it right there so that is how the desktop version works perfectly for yourself that is not to self it works perfectly I think you guys really need to try it out try link signal desktop to your phone and then you're good to go you can use your app right away very cool when it comes to the site you can just download whatever and then you can see emojis right here and then your stickers right here and then you are good to go so give the video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to the channel like this video share it to anyone i think that is going to be helpful to them and without further ado i'm just going to catch you in the next video